Okay, guys. Back at Agate Falls. Left Rocky in the vehicle. Left it running. So he's got some AC. And there is one vehicle here already, so I'm hoping that somebody else is down here, and that way I could kind of go based off of where they're walking, because I'm, I know it's possible, Nate did it with Line Cloud Avengers, so I know it's possible, but uh, I'm not sure how he did it. He did mention that it was like off the man-made trail, so let's check it out. Round two, Agate Falls. Okay guys, so this is the end of the platform here. And that is the view. Lots of trees in the way. And like I said, Nate has gone in down there and seen it from the ground level. So, my question is, how? Is this a trail right here? Is this a trail? I do not know. This is too hard to tell. I think I see a boot print here. Yeah. So, I'm gonna go somewhere this way and we'll figure it out. Okay guys, I think I found it. Platform there, I did cut off and there really is, it's hard to tell, there really, I want to say there is no trail from there, but once you get to this side, you can very easily see that there's a trail that cuts through here, but it is um, right alongside basically a cliff here, and the rain must have caused some mud sliding, but as you can see, a nice clean path and footprints so I might must be heading in the right direction okay guys so I made it to the bottom here but there's still a tree in my way so I'm very carefully gonna make my way across this log here There you guys go, Agate Falls. Wow, big shout out and thank you to Nate for putting this on my radar. Absolutely beautiful. And if I'm being honest, this might put Bond Falls to shame. This is so much larger and that water is really gushing today. So I'm glad I made it work. Okay guys, so I was talking to someone who actually has been coming out here for 15 plus years and he says there's actually a trail that goes all the way down the river more or less for miles and he did say that he was in the river one day with water shoes and he hears what, he's, what he thought was a dump truck and he's thinking what the heck? I'm miles out here. How is there a dump truck? No, what it was, was bears. And he said that they were jumping up and smacking the water. And he told me that up here, somewhere up is actually a bear's den. Um, full disclosure, I don't have my bear spray but they're gone. He said that uh, the bear den is caved in has been for years so they've moved further downstream. But just an amazing cool story there and I gotta say specifically shout out to my family here. My family grew up at Bond Falls in a way for generations and it's a very special place 
to me and my family. But I gotta say right now, this blows Bond Falls out of the water. Bond Falls does not even come close to this. That is gorgeous. So much bigger than Bond Falls. And he, he was telling me that back in the day, you could actually come out and it, it's washed up now a little bit. You can actually kind of see it. Real, right here. It's blocked by the fence, so you gotta go around. But there's a trail that brings you down to the middle of the falls here. And he that back in the day, you used to be able to walk out here and sit on those rocks right in the middle of it. So we're gonna go out here. I'm not gonna walk onto the waterfall, but I'm carefully making my way down and I'll get some photos and video for you guys. I think this is actually the bear den that he was referring to. You could see that it did in fact collapse at the back there because he said you can walk in and you can walk out of it. God, I'm so paranoid even though he said that it's been years and it's caved in. I am standing inside of an old bear den. This is absolutely insane. I don't like it. I'm running away though. I don't want to spend too much time there. I trust the guy and all, but man is that creepy. Cool, but creepy. I feel like I'm doing Log Hill all over again, you guys. At least this time, I don't have to climb it twice. And it's hard ground, not dirt. But we're almost there. Okay, guys. Oh my god, even that's a beautiful view. I didn't even notice that. But I am on top of that bridge now. This is one spot Nate did not know about. I ended up finding the trail on the walk over. God, this background's beautiful. But from up here, you can see another little fall there, and another one there. And then, this is an ATV trail, by the way, so you don't have to worry about falling through, but make sure you're keeping your eyes out in case an ATV comes. You got the Agate Falls. Pretty high up. But a gorgeous view. Okay, so now to go back to the AC. You guys can probably see it sometimes when the sun hits. I am sweating. So enjoy some nice AC with Rocky.